These are the Teach Me Fashion Summer Shorts. Before you cut these shorts out, please make sure they are long enough for the look you are after. If you want to lengthen them, just cut through the pattern above the curve and drop them a few centimetres or inches. If you are using a stripe or a check as I have done here, you need to cut out very carefully. I cut these pieces out individually as this is a one-way check and I needed to make sure the check continued around the body. Make sure if you do cut them out individually you end up with opposite pieces. Notch all your pattern pieces. Pin the front tuck into position. Take the pocket bag and facing and pin to the pocket front with the right sides together. Pin the waistband in half to form a tube. Stitch your pocket opening. Trim the seam allowance back by half. This allows you to turn the curve more easily. Now separating this seam and with the seam allowance underneath the facing, stitch within a couple of millimetres of the seam on the facing side. This edge stitch helps roll the facing back away from the front of the garment. Now if you are going to top stitch as I have done here, do your first row close to the edge and then using your machine foot as a guide, do another row parallel to the first. Now fold the pocket bag back into position using your notches. Stay stitch at the waistline. This will hold the tucks you pinned in previously as well. The bottom of the pocket is a French seam to hide all the seam allowance. So with wrong sides together, stitch across the bottom using half your seam allowance. Turn this through so you have the right sides together and stitch using up the remainder of your seam allowance. A very neat and tidy seam.
Now pin the front and back together at the side seam and stitch to the notch just before the curve starts. Make sure you reinforce this line. With right sides together, sew the short inside leg seams of the front and the back. Neaten these seams separately. Now neaten all the way around the side and around the bottom of the shorts. I have already prepared one leg of the shorts to speed up the video process but obviously you need to do both legs. To turn up the curve, sew an E-stitch or a gathering stitch on the very outside edge of the curve. Lay the garment on the table and pull up the ease stitch carefully until the seam allowance begins to curve in. Use a pin to help distribute the fullness evenly. Pin this into position. With right sides together, pin the two legs around the crotch seam. Neaten these seams together using a zigzag stitch or an overlocker. Now stitch the waistband together, leaving an opening in what will be the back of the waistband.
You will thread the elastic through this waistband opening later. Fold this waistband in half. Press to hold the fold. and press the hem of the shorts as well. Now with the seam allowance of the waistband matching the centre back seam of the shorts and the opening for the elastic facing inside, Pin and stitch the waistband onto the shorts. Neaten this seam with all seams together. Now measure your elastic by placing the elastic comfortably around your waist and allow it to overlap by a couple of centimetres or a half an inch. Mark where it overlaps and cut it. Thread the elastic through the opening in the centre back of the waistband. Pull both ends through. Cross them over and stitch securely into position. Stretch the elastic out and it will pop back into the waistband. Stitch the hem of the shorts to match the stitching around the pocket opening. Trim off any wayward threads and press your final garment. Well done. <laughs>